Alright guys, back again. I started a video and then I didn't really like how it was going because I was all over the place. I'm going to get into the water stuff again. Just another reminder that I always tell people. I told maybe hundreds of people today at work and whatever they do, they do. And uh, maybe at the end I'll explain what some of my lovely co-workers were, were thinking of me and whatnot. Which I don't care, I just think it's funny. But, you know, let's compare our lives and you know, we'll, we'll go from there and determine who's right who's doing right and who's doing wrong. Alright, so what I'm saying here is about the water stuff. I always tell people that they should definitely have bottled water and stuff and they should definitely have containers full of sink water. Any type of water you can have. I don't want to hear like I hear at work all the time, I have a generator, I'm good. No you're not, regardless. I have a well, I'm good. No you're not, regardless. I have a pond. No you're not, regardless. People don't imagine the things that go down when there's no water, no electricity. People become rabid, first of all. They're going to be coming around looking for all your stuff. And the more people that you can get to do this stuff ahead of time, the less likely you'll be troubled. Now, obviously, at that point, if it gets bad enough, you have to deal with government, police, all that kind of stuff coming to quote-unquote check on you. And I don't want the government feeding me, that's for dang sure giving me their Soylent Green, all their nasty food, their metals and all that crap in it. I'm good. You can take me. God can take me at that time. I'm good. I've lived a full life. And I'm here to put over as many people as I can, help them what I can. And I work my butt off every day on about everything I do. So I'm just going to keep on going. No matter how tiring it gets, how annoyed it gets people mocking you, they don't understand the system. I tried explaining today about how everything was being destroyed and whatnot. They're like, who's destroying it? And I say the government. The government's all working together. All the presidents, every country. You know, I could get into masonry, how they're all connected, how they're bloodlined in, how they breed with each other. You can go from the Rothschilds and Rockefellers, the Kennedys, the DuPonts, you know, etc. These people that own big businesses and control everything that really are the ones that actually determine everything. They are the ones that own the media. They tell everybody what to think, what to believe, and so on and so forth. So, yeah, that's a short little video. I think I'll cut it, and uh, hopefully I can put this on TikTok or YouTube or something, and it won't get shut down. Thank you guys for watching. Love you. Bye.